I am a resident and I have been since day one. I believe I was the first one to move into this complex. Uh, I moved in July 14th. Resident Guy Purnell is delighted with his new apartment, loves the neighborhood, and amenities at Bonnie Lane. Although Bonnie Lane opened last summer, Two, three. the recent open house and dedication ceremony this year was a picture-perfect celebration for residents and their dedicated staff. I love my neighbors. I live next door to a young lady by the name of Shirley. Her and I, we knock on each other's wall from time to time, but she's really good. I love my neighbors. I love all of these, uh, you know, of all the tenants, we are, you know, you're in good company when you're in uh, one of these facilities. Conveniently located directly across from the Cora Coleman Senior Center and the Bob Price Rec Center, Clark County teamed up with Accessible Space Incorporated to build Bonnie Lane. And you see furniture around here that's kind of, that would Bundling tax credits with state and federal financing yep. And but having yeah, Wells Fargo as the equity investor, the 66-unit apartment building is beautiful, safe, and an affordable place with wheelchair access throughout. Accessibility for Crowett isn't necessarily wheelchair accessible. For example, a three-foot stand-up shower and a rail is accessible, but it doesn't do anything for somebody in a wheelchair. So we contemplate, we go beyond, way beyond the code requirements for accessibility because, again, we're trying to make this as, as friendly for that person in their home, so they don't have to work to, to use, the, use their unit. Accessible Space Incorporated has collaborated with Clark County and more than 20 affordable housing complexes throughout the valley. Clark County is steadfast in its commitment to provide housing for low income, disabled, elderly and veteran citizens. We have a lot of seniors who are both resident seniors and people moving to our community and um, Keeping pace with senior housing and especially senior affordable housing is uh, one of their critical priorities. 